have been well trained. Yes. <laughs> Opus 131 is a quartet that really exemplifies counterpoint and structure. Um, I think the opening is the, one of the best examples of how a melody, in this case, so, somewhat like a fugue, um, Beethoven uses and each voice enters and really speaks to, uh, to the music individually and then together create this wonderful, wonderful music. Opus 131, Beethoven described as his ultimate composition and we're so fortunate to have this music to play and to be able to engross ourselves in his genius every day. Uh, Beethoven, in this piece, really, he expands upon the expressive abilities of, a, of an ensemble and it really is stunning that with only four instruments he's been able to elicit so many different feelings and emotions. This quartet is in seven or eight movements, seven movements and the entire quartet has no stops, it's all a taka, so when we finish it's the end, it's not the first movement. <laughs> But each, each of those seven movements really has a different expressive quality and, and core um, emotion to it. And I think it really is an emotional roller coaster ride Beethoven takes us on. And uh, I think this piece itself exemplifies his heroic uh, ideals and transcending them, in fact, to, uh, to perhaps something even greater. So, without any further ado, here is Opus 131, C-sharp minor.
if it's too dark.